Guys, yes. what money he promised my me? Mm -hmm. My gift, yes. and it fucking came. Apparently, it came. Okay. So Brother. let's see. Mm -hmm. As you can see, Every Ooh. joke everywhere. Damn, buddy. Yes. Yes. Thanks, buddy. Thanks. Welcome. <laughs> Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Azinne Williams. How are you all doing? Hope you guys are good. Hope you guys are fine. If you're new to this channel, kindly click on the subscription button. Click on the notification bell to let you know whenever I post any new video. Okay, guys. So I just finished seeing Mercy's reality show, which is Mercy What Next. Yes, guys. And this time around is just Mercy and is the season two. Last season was about she and Ike Mercy and Ike reality show. This season, um, this episode, the, um, the premiere, of course, Ike was featured. I think it's already things that has already been, um, they've already filmed that before now, before they had their breakup and everything. So I'm just going to give you guys a summary or some of the highlights of some of, or some of the changes that, ha that has happened, you know, since last season. And then tell you guys what I think, and then we'll move on to other gist. Then subsequently... As they air other episodes, I will be giving you guys a rundown of whatever it is that happened. Yes, you guys have succeeded to make me review this show. Yes, guys. So let's start. Of course, I told you um, we saw some of the things that happened last season with she and Nikki, how the relationship did not work, you know, everything, you know, that you guys know about her relationship with Ike last season. If you guys did not catch up with last season, um, there is a playlist I made for Messi and Ike reality show where I reviewed everything. So just go check it out and then you'll catch up. Yes. So, um, Messi told us that the relationship between she and Ike has packed up, um, basically because she said, um, age the friends and I was looking forward to settling down while EK was not looking forward to that and she said 80% um, of the reason why their relationship packed up has got to be EK's fault. Ouch! <laughs> Anyways, um, she has moved on. She has a new man in her life, but the man no like wahala. You know, like social media wahala. You know, he told her carry your cross by yourself. I am not here for that social media thing. But it looks like the man put a ring on there because she showed us a ring, and then she told us about her upcoming projects, things she has been doing. She's now into oil and gas. She supplies diesel to people. Lambo Homes is doing well. M and M Luxury is about to launch her um fiscal shops as the offline shop you know she's working with brands she's really doing great and she said ever um during this episode she has not really had time to travel and everything she's now into films she's not being more serious with her filming uh or her film career and all that she showed us a bit of that you know um during the show she also told us that she has two people you know that she has joined um that have joined her in her pr Part of her PR team, Miss Tessie and Miss Flora. Um, glad is it Gladys or Gloria? I don't know her name. She's still there as her PA. Um, she added another car to her fleet of cars, a Range Rover Vala. Of course, we know that. Yes, and she's trying to walk out. I don't understand that kind of workout though, because that is a boom boom workout. That's something I can do. Trust me, I'm not a fan of walking now. You know, but that kind of messy workout, I can totally do it. Let my bum bum do the work. Anyways, guys, don't mind me. You know, um, she also talked with her sister about her mom coming over from Emo State. You know, basically, that's what the show is all about. Trying to introduce us to this new season and what to expect. So, um, I didn't really get much, to be very honest. I didn't get much from this episode. I didn't. The only thing I got was EK. And Mercy no longer together. Mercy has a new man who put a ring on it. She is trying to get her physical shop running. She's now into oil and gas. And she has two people that has been added to her PR team. These are like the new information I got. Other than that, I really don't understand the other things that happened. But they showed us that subsequently we are going to be having more action. Her mom is going to come. She's going to be hanging out with Zuby Michael. Oh, she also showed us where she had um, this... I don't know what to call it. This party with Moet and her, is it Moet and her sisters, you know, and everything. So basically that's it. Nothing much in this episode, to be very, very honest. I expected more. I mean, being that this is the premiere show. <laughs> but um, I was kind of disappointed, to be very honest. But 
Looking at it from last season, should I even be expecting more? Mm, no. But one thing I love about it is the originality in this whole thing. The part where she started speaking Igbo, and not, be not because I'm an Igbo girl, but because a lot of people tend to pretend in quotes in a reality show and they start for me oh not, like that conversation she had with her sister via the phone i love that part i love the fact that she was being real she was being messy i mean she was being messy though like mercy ak and all that so yes but after that ugh, it was just flat yeah it was but i'm expecting more i mean looking at the things they showed us to come to be michael you know all the excitement her sister's coding her telling her about oh not starting her shop and everything i'm also looking forward to all that so we keep our fingers crossed and we're looking forward to episode two which is going to be next week sunday yes guys Good morning. <laughs> um angel sasuke and wine money are in abuja at the moment yes guys as they were welcomed you know by their fans i mean fanfare pageantry and all that one thing i love about you know their uh coming to abuja white money and angel came at the same time sasuke was on a different flight you know but one thing i love about white money was the way he held angel like his baby sister like his you know like you know when you are traveling with your elder brother like the first son of your house the way they'll hold you like so may you don't go lost you know that kind of a thing yes you know i love that about white money well done well done to him he has lived up to his name you know he has shown us that this is white money like the white money we saw in the baby and niger house is still the white money that we are seeing now he even went ahead this morning to fulfill the promise he made to cross and emmanuel by gifting them those shoes i love me those shoes white money where is my own i love boots i love sneakers i love those kind of very comfy shoes yes and um yeah that is it and katrina yes the boss lady has informed us that she is going to turkey to get her veneers done it looks like this teeth thing is like the newest is it's like the in thing right now everybody wants to get veneers done but i don't know i've seen her teeth and to me it's not bad or is it? It's not bad to me. Like, why would I want to get veneers? I think it's like for those that maybe has um, injuries to their teeth, you know, and that actually needs it, those that have lost teeth and there's really nothing that can be done except for that. I think that's what it is. Or those that really have very, 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 very bad set of teeth, then maybe you need that. But aside from that, I don't know why people are just doing it just for, you know, you can actually get braces. You can get... um scaling and polishing um, teeth whitening she really has good set of teeth i be i'm missing something maybe i am or maybe i've not seen the full team maybe there's something wrong that i do not know but she is actually going there she told us it's not sheep it's not what it's not sheep you think i'm lying what listen to her guys i'm flying to ismail turkey monoclinic to have my veneers um, some people call it the Hollywood smile so it's a procedure whereby they they cover up your tits with a whiter shade so that's what I'm going for and it doesn't come cheap guys it doesn't come cheap takes a lot of this a lot of this to get that done so when you see me smile be humble what did I say be humble <laughs> did I not tell you she said it's not sheep next time if you want to go get your veneers done remember what Katrina said it is not what sheep thank you very much yes guys so yes i'm anticipating you know angel and white money you know to see them at the hustle and bustle tonight it's not if i'm going there 
you know, it's not my thing. But I can't wait to see them party with um Obikubana. Yes, he's the owner of Hustle and Bustle. So it's going to be lit. Yes, guys, it's going to be lit. So yes, guys, that's it for me. Thank you guys so very much for being part of my channel. If you've not already subscribed, kindly click on the subscription button. Click on the notification bell to let you know whenever I post any new video. Until I come your way again, I remain your darling girl, Azine Williams. Have yourself a beautiful, wonderful day ahead. Bye, guys!